Hi, I'm Griffin. And hi, I'm Susan. And we're living the adventure in Villa de Leyva, Colombia. And you're watching Fun for Louie. Boom. Boom. Good morning, guys. I just arrived at LAX after the most hectic morning. Basically, uh, I've been waiting for the vehicle documents to arrive and I missed them on Friday. So I had to go to the DHL office this morning. Uh, all the boys flew out last night, I was supposed to be with them. But anyway, I've got the documents. I'm at the airport, I'm running a little bit late. I'm just about to go through security. And uh, yeah, jump on a flight to Mexico. If you don't know, I'm going to go and pick up a school bus that I, uh, that I, I purchased. And it's pretty epic, you'll see it tonight. Guys, I brought a penny board. I have not had a penny board in the airport for so long. I think my flight is just boarding, which is a relief. Oh, look how sandy the penny board is. <laughs> Straight from the beach. I'm just doing a speed test, and this is looking pretty awesome. 90 meg up from LAX. Yes, check this out. Three minutes remaining. I literally just clicked upload. Oh, I remember you. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Thank you. Time for a four hour flight. The boys have messaged me saying they've got a hotel room for the day because they just need to rest up. JP flew in from New Zealand. If you saw him, last night in my vlog and um, yeah I probably need to rest a little bit before we head off on our road trip back. Welcome to Cancun, that was a really good flight. I slept for most of it, managed to get quite a bit of editing done and uh, just pinged a message to the boys. I think we're gonna meet up, grab some dinner and then uh, grab a cab down to, to the bus which is parked just under an hour away. I'm really excited for this. I can't wait to show you guys and I can't wait to drive it back to California. So today has been all about logistics. Firstly, picking up the vehicle documents in the morning, trying to get to the airport in time. Then it's been liaising with Sam, JP, and Sam's friend, Max. Uh, they're staying at a hotel nearby, like I said. And, um, and now it's been talking to Pablo, who I'm buying the bus from, and Beto, who you remember from when we came to Tulum, he was the tour guide. He's gonna be joining us on the trip just it's probably wise to have a Mexican with us who kind of knows about how to travel and where's safe and not. Anyway, I've been trying to liaise to make sure that we can all meet. Beto, unfortunately, has had a family emergency and he's near Mexico City right now. So we might need to leave. I've just been on the phone to him. We might need to leave first thing in the morning, like super early, and try and cruise all the way through to Mexico City. Apparently, it's like an 18 hour drive. So we should get there for t tomorrow evening. Uh, and we're on our own till then, basically. So I haven't told the boys this yet, but I'm hoping that's all gonna work out. Uh, yeah, this is gonna be a crazy adventure. I can't believe it's all come together. I, uh, I'm quite excited. I've been a little bit stressed about kind of making sure it all happens and they're on their way now to pick me up with Pablo, so it's all good. What are you saying, bro? You, you, you got to get him. <laughs> yeah, I thought I'd bring it. I saw you guys cruising. Yes, around. bro. <laughs> How are you doing, bro? What's going on, bud? <laughs> bro. All right. Hey, good to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thanks. How are you? Good? Yeah, good. I've had a good flight. Yeah, yeah. Time to go and find the bus. Oi, you don't understand how excited oh, I am. So, so excited. Okay, we've arrived at Playa del Carmen and Pablo's just picked up the keys. This is a really special moment. Got the keys and we're now about to arrive and see the bus for the first time. I can't wait for the grand reveal. I know. Really sick. There it is. Can you see it, guys? There's my bus. That's it. Oh, just winking at us. Oh my god. We are going to drive that to California. <laughs> <laughs> it's so sick. 
It's huge. It's huge. Yeah, the it's biggest bus yes. in the whole of Mexico. <laughs> Massive. Like the biggest you've ever seen. Okay, guys. There she is. My new bus. This is where I reveal to you guys who previously owned this bus. You, you saw this if you watched my Mexico vlogs. We met with Felix and Sally, who then went to visit in Germany. They drove this bus, they, they decked this bus out, drove it from Alaska uh, down to here for a, a movie they've actually made, which I'll link below all the details. Uh, and yeah, and then they finished the project uh, and now I've managed to get hold of the bus. Welcome to your bus. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> Oi, boys. Oh my god. What are you saying? What? No. Oh my god. Isn't this incredible? <laughs> what is this? You would just never believe what it. You'd this? never believe it. No. Look at the bed. <laughs> You see pictures, but it doesn't even do it justice. It's like... The coffee machine! <laughs> Check in there, bro. Oh my god! There's a full-on tile chair in here. What are you saying, JP? Oh, I can't swear on your blog, but holy crap, it's amazing. <laughs> oh, what do you reckon, Max? Unbelievable. It's unbelievable. Like, the wooden finish, the, like... It's, it's, like stepping, it's like stepping into Narnia. What? <laughs> what, boys? Yes! Oh! It's time to start the bus! Is this, the, is this the right key? Yeah. Straight up! First time starting the bus. Ah! This is like Christmas. I'm like, I, I haven't seen you this happy in a long I'm time. Beyond like, <laughs> <laughs> this engine is bigger than me. It dips it, and I guess that's where you pull the oil away. Thank you so much. Enjoy it. Yeah, and we will. You, we definitely you know, will. You, you, you will. It's the most beautiful thing. In the most beautiful bus ever. So. It is the most beautiful yeah. bus ever. Pablo, oh, no, very nice. I'm bringing it in here. Bring it in. All right, Pablo's gone. I have the keys. I have the keys. <laughs> boy, yes, boys. <laughs> what are you saying, JP? <laughs> what do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Right, we're finally off. I'm trying to figure out the turning circle. Oh, oh, that is. That's nice. That's nice. We're gonna upset so many people. <laughs> yeah. I think a lot of these amateurs driving school buses. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Woo! <laughs> oh my gosh, wow. this is narrow. Oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. Are, we sure, are we supposed to be on this? Flip an egg, this feels so bloody narrow. Well, I've just done my first little drive of the bus. We've arrived in Cancun, that's like an hour on the road. Just uh, grabbing the boys' bags before we head off in the next leg but yeah that was a lot of fun it's feeling um pretty sluggish it's just so heavy i guess i'm not used to driving heavy vehicles i, I have driven buses in the past but it was uh it's going to take a bit of getting used to and we got tunes that's a sound system this is the sound system oh my gosh <laughs> when you hear the sound box oh, they're not messing around are they no <laughs> When I try to show you song is meant to keep <laughs> Max is gonna take the next driving shift. We have blocked the entire road. Don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it. We've got a 
first fuel stop. Do you reckon that's it? Yeah. Yeah? Diesel. Diesel, yeah. We yeah. had half a tank. And he still put in 132 litres. Wow, it just keeps going. Even more? It just keeps going. Bro, it's 140 litres. What? Maybe it's... A, what? Maybe it's a 300 litre tank. Cheers. First Red Bull of the road trip. <laughs> it's about 3.30 in the morning. The boys are going to do a couple of shifts of driving. I'm going to get some sleep so I can do an early morning drive. We're going to try and cover as much distance as we can at the beginning of this trip so we can take our time the last few days just to, you know, see the sights and, uh, and enjoy as much as we can being in Mexico. Um, yeah, it's, we have no idea what's going to happen, if there's going to be any problems we need to solve or um, issues with the bus, but this is all part of the adventure for me and yeah, this is uh, ushering in a new era of adventures on my channel and I don't know, I'm just super excited. I hope you guys are too. And I'll catch you in the morning. Peace out, enjoy life and live the adventure. Boom.